What's happening, my loyal subscribers? I'm over here in the house and we just had a big freaking thunderstorm. So there's no power right now. So I've just been reading some books, getting some shit done. I decided to make a video because, you know, I'm committed to this video a day. Shit. And today I want to talk about taking 100% responsibility to your life. 100% responsibility for all the things in your life. And we've talked about this before, but it needs to be really nailed down into um, your mindset because people need to internalize this because it's so important. Because I look around often and I see the victim mindset. I see people always blaming something, always pointing at something. They're always like, it's because of this person that this hasn't happened. It's because I have these parents that I'm like this. It's because of the government, my society, the new laws, Donald Trump, all these fucking excuses, all right? There's no time for excuses. Your life is because of you, all right? Some situations I know you are, are not in your control. Sometimes you are actually born into shitty situations. Maybe your parents have a mental disorder or you have a legitimate disability. You have something that's actually a bit of a disadvantage. These things happen, I understand that. I'm not so ignorant of the facts of life. But there is one thing that is empowering that we all have, and that's the ability to make choices in reaction to the things that occur in our lives. So regardless of whatever it is, in the terms of your life, it's up to you to change it. If you are in a bad situation in your marriage, maybe it's not your fault, maybe your spouse is legitimately psycho, but it's up to you to maintain your happiness and get yourself out of that situation. How are you going to deal with it? Are you going to get some therapy for this person? Are you going to leave? It's up to you to decide. You're in 100% responsibility for your happiness and your circumstances. Maybe you're living in a place where the economy is absolute shit. It's still up to you to change it. You want to become a millionaire, you're going to have to figure it out. You're going to have to get out of that situation. You're going to have to move countries. You're going to have to figure it out. It's just your responsibility because it's your life. It so might... perhaps you get fired. It's time for you to get a new job. Time for you to educate yourself. Time for you to get some new skills that are going to make you more valuable in the workplace. Make it harder for you to get replaced. Perhaps your girlfriend dumps you. Perhaps she cheats on you. Maybe it's time for you to improve the type of women you get with. Improve yourself to become someone who's not so easy to cheat on. Or maybe, maybe the houses in your area are expensive and it's hard to move out of your house. Maybe you need to become a, a bit more cluey about the market. Re Relocate, go somewhere else, move, change the locations, go somewhere where houses are a little bit cheaper. There's always options, guys. You can't sit there and complain. You're in full responsibility. If you are not where you want to be, don't blame another motherfucker. It's your fault. It's your fault for not doing what you need to do. And I think we all deep down inside know this. But the good thing is, if you take this mindset and you carry it with it, you own it, it means that you are now empowered. It means that whenever you see a situation that you don't like, whenever something is not to your taste, you now have the power to change it because you know that you create your life through your thoughts, your emotions, your reactions, and the things you visualize every day. You create it. You're a creator. The mind is a creating device, and this is our playground. I don't like living in this house. It's up to me to change it. If I don't like this fucking haircut, it's up to me to change it. If I don't like the way this beard grows, it's up to me to change it. If I don't like the way I've been doing this YouTube channel, the success I'm getting on it, it's up to me to change it. If I don't like whatever the fuck I don't like, it's up to me to change it. So that's the mindset I want you guys to take. take so when you really internalize this mindset, things get easier. Because you gain a sense of control. You gain a sense of power because you see all the little actions you do in life and you can see the grand scheme of things. You can see how they create the bigger picture. You can see how every day the choices you make in reaction to whatever happens 
point towards or get you moving towards a certain direction. Now, what direction do you want? You can visualize right now. You can think about it. Where do you want to go? And then you can choose the right actions. And then you can take full responsibility of if you get there or not. Don't be one of these people that are always crying and whinging, crying about stuff. There's no time for that. They use that as an outlet to kind of, how shall I say, feel like they're doing something. But if you look and observe the nature of complaining, you can see quite quickly that it fucking does not generate any results. So there's no point in complaining. Stop complaining. Take full responsibility of your life. Grab life by the balls. Do what you have to do, man. Don't complain. Look at my chickens over here. You think my chickens complain? You think that chickens complain because the other one just stole something? It's not complaining, it's too slow. Take a full responsibility of your life and trust me, you will see great changes, guys. And anyway, that's the video for today. Real quick, real short, real sweet, but very important. Internalize that shit. It's not, it might not be your fault, but it's your responsibility. Everything counts. Anyway, peace. Just do it!